All right, guys, so what we have to figure out now, why this bulb out indicator is still, still staying on because all my bulbs are working. All right, so I can even do headlights. You can see I replaced all the bulbs. All these bulbs are on. These two bulbs are on and everything, but it's still showing me that the bulb is out. These turn signal lenses are right there. I'll be replacing those. I have new ones on the way. So I'm trying to disconnect this uh, headlamp monitor unit, but it's like, it's all like floppy in there and it's, so I'm gonna have to try to figure something out. The battery's disconnected right now, so. But I need to take it out and take it apart and probably resolder the, the all the joints on it because the light still says that uh, my lights are out even though all of my lights are working. So I have to do that. Finally got it out. Okay, it was a bit of a pain. Yep. So it's super weird. I mean, I'm... Just assuming that somebody didn't plug it in or didn't uh, know how to unplug it or something and now all these connectors are just you know loose unfortunately so i'm gonna see if i can maybe fix them but i don't know guys i'll have to check on this so what's interesting is that they go down like this you can push down on them those three connectors and they're not gonna fall through so i don't know but i still I think it should be like that could be i mean i'm not certain but as you can see this one is like stationary it's not going anywhere but these three are just yeah so but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and disassemble this uh really one of these days this is a module and really hoping i want to fix this car yeah i'm gonna fix this uh issue with uh you know it showing the thinking that one of my lights is out a few moments later All right, guys, so here's the lamp monitoring unit for this car. And I had it actually taken apart, didn't film everything, but uh, what I did is I actually had it apart and I resoldered all the joints on both sides. There's a lot of solder joints. I did those and we'll see what happens now. This style of a monitoring unit for your burnt out bulbs um, is actually not just on the W124s, the, the R and W126s and uh, a couple other cars actually so and this one sits in there I'm just gonna go ahead and reinstall it and you know hopefully i'm really hoping it's gonna fix that stupid light it's not gonna be coming on on the dash um yeah if you guys have any ideas what else it could be let me know but that's my only culprit is this module right here because all the bulbs are working on this car everything is operating there there are no led bulbs anywhere installed so yeah, go ahead and install this bad boy. After you're done, we're gonna install the cover. Just simply slides on there like that and install those Phillips screws. Unfortunately, didn't help right here. As you can see, that light is still on. Sadly. 